The 24-hour news channels operate on a business model of stoking the culture war in an attempt to make normal politics seem like a life-or-death blood sport. 29-year-old Anthony Cross of Billings, Montana drank that partisan Kool-Aid and came to believe that the political positions of President Joe Biden and U.S. Senator John Tester were so beyond the pale that it was incumbent upon him to personally stop them. Anthony filmed multiple videos for his YouTube channel saying that he was going to personally murder the president President, while also threatening the life of the senator. In a separate video, he also threatened to kill other Democratic politicians, as well as transgender people. And while the FBI was investigating these threats, Anthony was arrested by local police for threatening his neighbor at the trailer park where he lived. He brandished a pellet gun designed to look like a Glock pistol at the lady and gave her quite a scare. Now, this wasn't my case, but I'm getting the impression that Anthony may have some anger management issues, and his diet of toxic right-wing media may have thrown gasoline onto that flame. A grand jury in Montana indicted him for the threats against the two politicians, and he's facing a statutory maximum penalty of 21 years in federal prison. In this world of abundance and things to do, I will go to my grave not understanding why anyone chooses partisan politics as their hobby or personal identity. To me, it is mystifying. Have a great day and be cool.